lazy anim represents the highest caliber of students. Everyone here is committed to greatness, to constantly being in a constant state of improvement. Everyone here wants to reach their full potential, and there's people here to support you. This is a unique place. I, the, you can get a quality education at a number of schools in this area, but if you want to talk about educating the complete person, um, the complete young man, not only in the conventional math and English and science and things of that nature, but helping that young man grow and develop uh, emotionally and spiritually, I believe this is by far the best choice you could ever make. Our students uh, excel in many ways, in many areas, and that becomes our reputation. Uh, our reputation does attract students, the top academically, the top athletically, uh, kids who are great in service, uh, kids who are great actors and, and artists, uh, it attracts the best. The bulk of my experience was nothing but positive at the school from the diversity aspect of meeting new individuals from different backgrounds and different walks of life. I think this school is able to bring everyone together uh, for one common goal uh, and actually creates a family type of atmosphere. It brings a melting pot of different students together from all different states, from all different backgrounds. And, you know, it's, it's like these walls here. It's the mortar that brings us all together. So I think that diversity is what makes this school great and is what makes it a special place. And I think for my kids, it's important for them to be around a lot of different, different students and from all walks of life. When they were in class next to each other, you know, there was just an interaction. I mean, everybody was friendly and everybody, everybody just kind of respected one another. It was, I haven't necessarily seen that, you know, it, work as effectively in a life situation as it worked here. I don't think you can actually put a dollar value on it, but that value that you're giving that student is going to potentially change, if they so choose, it's going to change the things that they're able to ultimately do in life and avenues that they're able to ultimately pursue. A uh, prime example would be someone who uh, might have the desire to go to the school but not be able to actually physically or financially afford that. I can't put a value that would be as high as the education uh, that I personally received here. I mean, I can't, I can't personally quantify that. I know that this was where I wanted to go. I know the sacrifices that my family made. I know many, many uh, students over the years who would not be able to um, attend were able to attend because of some amount of, of, of assistance that they were given. Those students, many of those students now in turn are giving back to Salesiana to allow more students to come in. I think when you put up dollars and cents on it, you've kind of lessened the real impact. I've provided X to the student over a four year period. But in the essence, you've provided an opportunity to that student. You provided an opportunity to that family. And as that student goes on, you essentially can sort of change the arc of an individual. Come here and experience this place because you can feel it in the halls. You can feel the presence of the commitment of the teachers and the staff. And then you can feel it in the student body. The feeling of, of just, just giving and knowing that you're making a difference, no, no matter what it is, uh, just try to give something and your actions will set an example for your family and it's something to be proud of. And you will give somebody else the opportunity to achieve what you've achieved. Uh, it's gonna help their family. It's gonna be able to provide a opportunity for someone potentially less fortunate than you. Uh, and ultimately it goes back to you know, the model of the school. It goes back to what the school is ultimately always about. Uh, and I think that's a common theme that is shared not just with the current students, but with the alumni as well. We all share um, that same Salesian spirit. And I think that if we keep that in mind, um, it's not so much about the uh, financial sacrifice, but it's about the uh, blessing that you can ultimately bestow upon someone else. There's a group of people who should have this discipline, should have this exposure, but can't afford it, as my mother couldn't. She could not afford $60, but I was sent here anyway, and it made a big difference. I'd like to feel as though when I contribute, 
I'm going to make a difference for some other kid. And that's why I tell my classmates every year, let's contribute and pay back to what we were given by going to Silesianum. <laughs>